So here we have a model of the band and the port. So if you can picture the skin layer over this port right here, um, I'm just going to try to find the center of it. And then once I'm comfortable with the center, I'm just going to slide my fingers off to the edges of the port. And then again, I'm going to be going for the middle of my fingers with the needle. We do use special needles that go right into the port, and that way they don't core out the, the port itself so it doesn't leak. So at that point, I would just be injecting the fluid, pulling back to confirm I'm in the right spot, and then once I'm done, I just pull the needle out, and we're done. When we're injecting the fluid through the, the tubing here, it's blowing up the balloon on the inside of this band, and that's what's giving the patient more restriction. When you have more restriction, it holds the food up into this little pouch above the band, and when the food stays in here and stretches out a little bit, you get that, full, uh, that feeling of satisfaction and fullness with those little meals. We can also remove fluid the same exact way. Instead of having fluid in the syringe, we just put the needle through there, suck out some fluid, and it actually loosens the band up because it takes fluid out of the balloon.